before I came here, I was just getting into trouble, basically. Part of what I like about working here is I can see the kids um, changing over time. A lot of them come in um, from um, some pretty rough backgrounds and uh, they have, haven't really had anything to look forward to. I always say they, they only think about five minutes ahead at a time. They only think of what their immediate um, surroundings are and how they can react to that. About like three, th two months in, uh, in my house arrest, I got tired of my uh, home situation, so I uh, I cut my brace bracelet and ran away. And then I was away from home for about like seven months, and then I realized that I couldn't really. I ran away to do better for myself, so I can go, go away from the negative negativity. But I realized after seven months that I couldn't do nothing. I couldn't find a job because I was on the run. We work a lot with um, trying to establish goals for them, life goals, and uh, you know, you 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 see them change where they were before their, all of their goals were very short-term based, then they start to think about what their life's gonna be like a year from now, or three years from now, or five years from now, where before they never thought of that. They have finally something to look forward to. They have, um, they have a real sense of self-worth, where they have um, skills, um, they have the ability to make things, and um, they, they have a lot of pride in the work that they do, where they have built a, a boat or a paddle board or a paddle or a wooden cleat or any, any of the um, entry-level projects that we have here, um, and then they show it off to people, and it is good work, and so people are genuinely impressed by it, um, and then you can just sort of see the pride in them swell up from having from having made all that. The other big difference that you notice too is that um, they come in there. Um, they there's always a, some level of attitude, um, and they just kind of begin to soften as people. Um, um, they. The, you can see it with our volunteers working with them. You know, they, these kids just haven't had a lot of positive adult role models in their lives. And so to have not only one person, but several people who know their name, talk to them every day, ask them how things are going, show them new things, teach them new skills, um, it, it really helps create a community um, for these kids that they just, and it's really positive. Um, nurturing community that they haven't had before and so they really respond to that and you can see the, the changes you know from they're just generally happier they they have more self-confidence um, and they and they work um, they they are enjoying what they're doing um, and they and they genuinely want to get better um, and they really start to look forward to things more in their life. Everybody in here, like, do their work and stay focused. That's the best thing you gotta do here, like, stay focused and get past the program, then move on in life and do better things. I really didn't, I really couldn't see myself working a job, I guess, but came here, met some cool people. Some cool people that wanted me to change my ways, I guess you could say. And then 
and I just started seeing life as like more like I just wanted to get more out of life basically. Awaken to 